Greetings in the name of Jesus. I'm David November from Jesus to my rescue. And today I just want to share with you that Jesus will come to your rescue. It doesn't matter what your circumstances is, it doesn't matter what you're going through, but He's able to do exceedingly, abundantly above whatever you can imagine. I want to share with you that one day Jesus was walking along the beach and he called his disciples. He says, come and follow me. And so they followed Jesus and later he said, you will do greater things than what I can do. And so from that it had the ripple effect. Um, and today I'm also a disciple of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I want to bless you with uh, the word that says that Luke uh, chapter 1 verse 37 says, With God nothing is impossible. But the verse I want to leave with you is in Isaiah 43 verse 19, which says, Look, I'm doing a new thing. And that new thing has already started. So whatever you're going through today, Whatever circumstances you are in, what situation you are really in, maybe a desperate situation, maybe you're in danger, but today I want to draw your attention to the Word of God that says, look, I'm doing a new thing. And God is about to be doing a new thing in your life, like He's doing in my life. Where I'm standing today is not where I used to be. It's a, it's a place where I've never been. And God is doing a new thing in my life. Normally on a day like this, I will check up on the soup kitchen and see if everything is all right. But they are all right. And they're doing fine. And they're preparing for this afternoon for the children when they come out of school. And here I am in this wonderful place. You can see here, uh, oh, the water is nice. You can see there, my wife is sitting there. <laughs> Praise the Lord. So, God is doing a new thing. I've got a new cameraman. <laughs> you know, uh, I've got a friend there waiting for me. And I don't know where we will end up today. But the thing I want to tell you is that God is doing a new thing. And to those people who are thinking that they've got troubles, you know the word of God says troubles is just temporary. Your troubles is not permanent. God is about to be coming through for you and bless you and anoint you and make a way for you where there seems to be no way. And that is my life. My life is all about Jesus. Hallelujah. I just want to share the gospel of Jesus Christ with people. So Jesus will come to your rescue and he will make a way for you. He will anoint you, he will bless you. You know, the anointing of the Lord is upon me to preach the good news unto the poor and those who are poor in spirit. But let me pray with you. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, I bring my brothers and sisters right around the world before you. And I pray the anointing of God over their lives and the peace of God that passes all understanding. I pray that you shall make a way where there seems to be no way. Thank you, Lord, for what you're doing right now. The miracles that you're doing. Those who are sick, you touch them and you heal them. Those who are unemployed, you, you make a way for them, Father. Those who don't have food, you make a way for them, Father. Father, and those who are poor in spirit, Father, you just enrich them, and, and with your presence, you do great things for them. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. God bless you. Todaraba, bavakasha, shalom. Till next time, God bless you. Amen.